Hey guys, Cyberace TV here, and I'm going to get hands-on with iOS 4.0. Now, I've actually been wanting to install uh, the I iOS 4.0 on my iTouch for a couple days now, but I wasn't able to because the iTunes 9.2, which you need, was only available for Mac. But they just announced, uh, just re released it for uh, Windows today, and I was able to download it. And using a video I found, I was able to download the software and um, manually update my iPod to this without uh, getting rid of any information. It still has everything perfectly fine in it. I will put the video in the sidebar that uh, helped me out because that video has all the links to the downloads. All you need to do is um, download whatever the software for whatever device you're using iTouch 3G, iTouch 2G, um, iPhone 3G, iPhone 3GS, and then you uh, hold down uh, Shift and click on the Check for Updates button, and you find the file on your computer and update it. Uh, that's if you're using a uh, Windows computer. If you're using a uh, Mac, I believe you click Alt, and then click on the uh, Check for Updates thing. But anyway, enough about trying to install this. Let's get on with the features, shall we? So, uh, the first feature is definitely that you are allowed to uh, have a wallpaper throughout your whole iPod Touch. As you can see, I have a nice dark red background here, and it really makes the iPod look a lot nicer, as you can see. And I really like this new feature. The only thing that stinks is that there's no option to actually remove the background. If you want to change your background, you can't just set it back to the default that comes on the iPad. You have to just change it to another picture, which I think is very stupid. Another awesome feature is definitely the multitasking. Uh, you just have to double click the home button here. And there you go, you have a window of all your stuff open. I have Safari. I have... Doodle Jump, that's glitching up a little bit because I messed up. See Doodle Jump open. I have uh, all, a bunch of different stuff. Keyboard open. See, I have all the stuff open right there. Which, you know, the multitasking just really cool on this thing and it's really a great feature and another thing that they have that is new is definitely I believe it's called Game Center which you open that up you uh, sign in see and um, you uh, basically you get uh, it, you get to share your uh, stats and stuff with uh, other people you just add them which is also very cool uh, it's just you know it's very great um, you can also access your music right from the uh, multitasking menu. You see? So yeah, it's uh, really cool. I love uh, the new iOS 4, and uh, I'll definitely be making a lot more videos about it. This is kind of just a quick hands-on video here. And um, I'm going to be getting an Android tablet in the mail soon, so um, I'm going to be uh, doing some iOS versus Android videos, so look forward to that. I'm Cyberace TV, and thank you for watching today. I will see you guys later.